Stab me in the back. Where in the back? <clears throat> I can't sit down. Oh. Oh. And you, Micah? Oh, I'm done for, Noah. It's death and darkness for me. I'm a cold shadow. Throw me into the nearest cesspit. <laughs> <laughs> It's over. But who won? Who lost? care about the song as long as there's plenty of wine in the middle. Hey, aren't you staying for the orgy? I'm sick to my stomach from all this. I only hope God understands that I'm just doing my duty as a citizen, helping the city of my birth. What God is that? God of us all. Not the God of Sodom and Gomorrah. No. Sadly. Where is he now? Where does he dwell? It seems to me he's in the earth, in the sea, the air we breathe, he's all around us, lot. Oh. Mm. Though no one can see him. That's true. Or hear him. Maybe so. That's mighty convenient. How did you come to him, Miss Dollar? I don't know. Oh, no. You are my oldest friend, and I love you like a brother, but you're getting older by the day. No wonder people say you're touched to the head. She got a good heart. You want me to tell your wife that you'll be home in a few days? Yes, tell her you have to rest up. I'm wounded. You know, I usually take her everywhere with me, because it's better than having to kiss her goodbye. <laughs> You and your wife are like two peeves in the pod. <laughs> Come with me. Come with me. You're joking. Take care of me. And you. <laughs> Wait. Wait for me. Where's he going? This is the best part of war. Makes it all worthwhile. He, he's a strange one. <laughs> he's the best man you'll ever know. <laughs> Say another word against him, and I'll rip your heart out.
killing. Wish I'd been there. I'd have taken one or two heads, you can be certain. Oh, my God, man! Finish off tomorrow. Let's pass some. Let's take this. Rich pickings, man. Rich pickings. <laughs> That's all that matters. I'll call the children. Boys, boys, come and see who's here. Come on. Shimmy! Father! Dad. What was it like? Dad, Dad, was it glory? Dad! Dad. 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 Hurry! Tell me! Was it uh, Mr. Pat. Father! How many did you kill? Yeah. What was it like? <laughs> Tell me! Yeah. Was it scary? <laughs> you must have danced the sun when you won, Father. You must have killed hundreds. <laughs> Kill anyone. Did you bring us anything? Did you bring us a sword as a keepsake? Somebody's <laughs> ear. Did you bring us an enemy ear? Shh. Or a nose? <laughs> no one has more nose. Oh, we can put it on the mantelpiece. Oh, yeah. boys, your father's come a long way to see us. He's tired. Let him rest. All right, mother. We'll talk about this later. We should just be grateful that he's home. Oh, come on. Get some rest, father. Sleep well. <laughs> Destruction. Everyone in Sodom thinks it's right. We're the only person wrong. No, you are not wrong. Who said that? Who said that? I'm the Lord God, creator of heaven and earth. Is it really you, God? Is it you? Yes, it's me, Noah. But you speak with my voice. Of course. I'm the creator. Your voice is my voice. My voice is everywhere. Now listen carefully. We haven't much time. Mankind has turned wicked. We've forgotten how to listen. You alone, Noah, have remained pure enough, and therefore you can still hear me. I want you to come to the top of Mount Topek. Mount Topek? Where the top of Mount Topek? I'm waiting for you. On the top of Mount Topek. Can you explain to my wife, Nama, I'm going under your orders. I've just gotten back, you see. She will come to understand, but trust me and have faith. For you, Noah, are my chosen one. Me. But, Lord. Mount Tobik. Lord. spoke to God, and he answered me. What did he say? He said he wants me to go to Mount Topek to speak to him again. Oh, he did, did he? God spoke to me. It's true. about the fighting and the killing, Father. We won't have anything to boast about. Killing people isn't a subject for boasting, son. This is done. Don't you like doing it, Father? The Lord God doesn't like it. 
But everyone does it. That's why he's so angry. Has he told you, Father? No, but I know he is. You know a lot about God, don't you? Almost nothing. But it's more than most people. Get to work. That must make you very proud, Father. Remember the story about the little boy? So proud, he turned into a bee. Humming and buzzing. <laughs> Here I come! <laughs> Stop it! No, 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 Gotcha! <laughs> All right, that's it. That's enough. No fooling around. Let's get back to work now. Noah, Lot's wife is here. Where is my husband? He's uh, coming back with the army. Why didn't he come back with you? He was wounded. Wounded? Oh, wounded. A likely story. He will use any excuse not to come home. When they were raising the army, he was the first one to volunteer. The recruiting officer only had to say to him, we want you to, and he said yes, and he was out the door in a flash, and don't think that I don't know that you are his best friend, and you are in it together. Um, uh, there is no need to be abusive. Abusive? I am never abusive. I am hot-tempered, never abusive. Mother, is that why Lot doesn't want to come home? <laughs> I'll start out from Mount Topic this afternoon. The sooner I go, the sooner I'll get back. No argument? When it comes to the Lord, I have decided never to argue. But you always argue. Lord or no Lord? Yes, because I love you. Boys, come here. I'll be away for five days. I want you to take care of your mother and be good. In what order, Father? Do both at the same time. Stray dog she fed. Didn't leave. Couldn't move. And yet, after all these years, one glance from her can flood my soul. Hello? Lord! It's me, Noah. I've arrived. I'm here. Lord? Lord? I've come a long way. Noah? I'm here. Lord? I'm here, waiting patiently, as I told you I would be. Why have you asked me to come here? I have some rather shocking news. Sodom and Gomorrah. Be destroyed. Sodom and Gomorrah? By fire and brimstone? Because they have become an abomination to me. My creation, Noah, which I love. Will everyone perish? Everyone. Except you, Noah. You must take your family and leave Sodom. But Sodom's our home. Immediately. <laughs> but uh, how do I know you are who you say you are? And uh, uh, perhaps it's too early to ask you to have faith. 
need a sign, Lord? It wouldn't come amiss. Go back down the mountain. Now. Go! Yes. Oh. That sign enough for you, Lord? More than enough, Lord. You and your family leave Sodom. Hurry, there's hardly time. Is there no chance to save it, Lord? Save it? It's my hometown. Nothing would please me more. Could you find me 50 righteous people still living there? 50? Could you make it 10? Very well. If you can show me ten truly righteous people, Sodom is saved. Thank you, Lord. Ah, 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 ah. Be careful. Watch your step. Righteous people. Well, there's Lot for one. I wouldn't exactly call Lot righteous. No, but he's a good friend. And he's the cousin of your no good brother Abdi, so he's family. Very distant. What about his wife? She has got a tongue like a saw and a temper to match. She's. She's filled with envy and bitterness. I don't think she's ever helped anyone. But she is his wife. Very well, that's two. Good. Good. Uh, what about... Natan? That old goat sleeps with young girls, very young girls. Better to pick Jerome. Jerome does it with boys. What about Jerem? Jerem, Jerem is sleeping with Joshua's wife. Oh, no. You must know some truly righteous women in Sodom. Oh, oh, yes. There's, oh, no. Oh, there's, no, <laughs> she, she wouldn't do. Um, oh, no. How, how about, oh, no, that, that wouldn't. Sorry. I, I'm sorry. I don't know one. Sorry. We've got to put our heads together and think. We've got two we can recommend to the Lord God. We must be able to come up with another eight. So what do we have? Lot and his wife. Maybe that's why the Lord God let me pick ten. He knew I wouldn't be able to without cheating. And if I had cheated, he'd have known. Time for bed. Mama. Don't be too long, my dear. I couldn't find ten righteous people to recommend, Lord, without cheating, except Lot and his wife. And I'm none too happy with them. Then Sodom and Gomorrah are doomed. They're already marked down in the book. You must leave tomorrow, before noon. And neither you, nor Lot, nor your families must look back. Why not, Lord? You 
you'll be tempted to return and help those condemned to die. Set your face against their screens for help, Noah. broken God's law and he's going to punish them for it. Why do people anger him if they're going to be punished for it? Well, you boys find it hard to be good too, don't you? People find being good hard and they, they try to shake it off. But if God created people, why'd he create them so they broke his laws? Some questions don't have answers, Ham. But go on asking them. I do. <laughs> The city is going to be destroyed tonight. What? You'll be safe if you and your wife leave now. I don't want to leave. And don't look back. Oh, oh, who told you this? God. Oh, God. There's no time to explain, but I've never lied to you. Just leave. No, no. Don't look back. What did that old fool want, Lot? What was Noah doing here this time of the morning? He's my best friend. Why? I have never understood why. You have nothing in common. Noah's the only friend I know who's happy purely because I'm happy. Your happy friend threw me in a vat of red dye. So? So. So, is that all you can say? So what? <laughs> <clears throat> Man, you must have been love at first sight, because if I had taken a second look, I would have turned around and ran. The trouble with you is somebody once told you to be yourself. I'm going. Oh, going? Going? Good. I wish you were gone. Going where? Noah said Sodom was going to be destroyed tonight. You can stay here using up air if you like. I'm going. I'm staying. Goodbye. Goodbye. Doing. I don't want anybody robbing us. There is nothing worth stealing. Yeah. Whose fault is that? You're a jack of all trades and out of work in all of them. My mother always said that you would start at the bottom and work your way down. Your mother. Your mother's mouth is so big she can whisper in her own ear. Is this a provoked quarrel or can anyone join in? Where are you two going? Well, you see, my husband thinks that Sodom is going to be destroyed tonight. Are you drunk, Lot? No. Lot only drinks to calm himself. Sometimes he gets so calm, he can't move. <laughs> my God, my God. The shame of it. To be laughed at by people like that. I will never be able to hold my head up in decent society again. Never. Let go of me. It's disgusting. Where are we going, Father? I don't know. We can't wander the earth without a place to call home. The Lord God is our North Star. He'll show us the way.
What's going to happen, Mother? I'm frightened. So am I. Hang on to the cart. Hang on to the cart, boys. I look back. Why can't I look back? This is madness. Not that I could see our house from here. It's so small. Thanks to you, we have risen from obscurity to oblivion. I didn't know what happiness was till I married you. Now it's too late. That's the way it is. You don't deserve me. I had the sweating sickness. I didn't deserve that either. Listen, I'm going to take each day as it comes, and I have a feeling today is going to be special. I hope so, after all the trouble we've been through. <laughs>
I warned you. Pushing. to learn from children, how to be happy for no particular reason, how to forget the worst. I can't believe Sodom's gone. Lucky you're on such good terms with the Lord. He must hold you dear, for your prayers pierce the heavens and he hears you. He hears everyone. The truth is, Nama, I don't know why he picked me. The same reason I picked you. You're a good man with a good heart. It was love at first sight. It was love at first sight, Nama. Dear Nama. I wonder if Lot escaped. If he didn't, we're the only ones who know what happened to Sodom and Gomorrah. Maybe we'll meet a scribe one day and write it all down so future generations will know what happened. Oh, you can't trust them. Scribbling scribes have a very bad reputation. They change things. By the time they finish the story of Sodom and Gomorrah, they probably say we weren't even there. They couldn't get that wrong, Nama. I'm gonna speak with the uh, Lord. Well, while you're at it, you might ask him where we're going. talking to God again? Yes. Can he get God to give me a donkey? I've been thinking about God. Instead of letting people die and having to make new ones, why doesn't he just keep the ones he's got now? I'd like for all the bad things to stop. That will make everything much easier. We could all take a rest. We'll leave it to your father. He knows how to talk to the Lord. Sometimes it looks like he's just talking to himself. Nobody knows what he's doing. He looks so funny when he's doing it. <laughs> Once, a piper came to our street, and he played so sweetly that all who heard him started dancing. Even people who were just passing by joined in the dance. But a deaf man who knew nothing about music saw all these men and women dancing in the street. He thought they were all mad. 
squeal like that deaf man voice. We can't hear the music, but your father can. He's not mad. He's just dancing. To Gera. It's between Kadesh and Shur. What are we planning to do there? Be farmers. What do you know about farming? Nothing. We're in the hands of the Lord. Farming? Farming? Why farming? We're shopkeepers. What do we know about farming? Goats and cabbages, that's all. Did, friend. You're that more rap? Huh? We can get through. Don't shake your head at me. We're going to Sodom. Now, it's been meager pickings around here, friend. Just a few farmers who won't buy spit. <laughs> now we're going to Sodom. That's where the money is. Sodom's gone. Destroyed, deceased. Up in smoke. Life is filled with such sadness and sorrow. Sometimes I think it's better not to be born at all. Who do you meet in a lifetime who's that lucky? How did, how did it happen? God destroyed them for their wickedness. Some religious thing, huh? Ah. Well, it just proves don't Meddle with religions, it doesn't pay. I've always concentrated on profit. I, I believe that all the evil in the world comes from the fact that the gods didn't create enough money in the first place. There's something pure and decent about money. Now, oh, can I, uh, can I interest you good people in something? Everything your heart and hand desires. Ribbons, gigos, pots, pans, toys, hats. Ah, hats in the family. <laughs> hats. Oh, boys. Yes, it's very hot in Gerard. It hasn't rained in months. You'll need hats to keep off the sun. Oh. No, thank you. Oh. Oh. So beautiful. This is where God, Lord of all worlds, wants us to be. Come on, give it to me, it's mine. Up the hill, come on.
Can't make silk purses out of sow's ears. They're going courting. I want them to look their very best. You look very handsome, boys. Take care, lads. And watch out for trouble. Don't let them jump on you. Not the women, the neighbors. <laughs> we don't want any trouble, Father. We won't have any. They're frightened of us. We're different. You're different, all right. On your way. God for everything. None of them are very successful. Just look at this place. Yeah, but our God's different. It's just the one. The one and only God. Well, I suppose it makes it easier. Praying to one God instead of hundreds. And he's obviously superior to this bunch of failures. The truth is, Noah, everything is a miracle and a wonder. Miracle and a wonder. You always find the right words. And do you find the words behind the words? Softer, fainter, behind them the silence? Mm. You're shivering, my dear. Mm. Just fearful. I'm always afraid when the boys go into the village. They hate us there. They'll do us some mischief if they can. Where is everybody? Is Esther? You're sacrificing a virgin to the rain god Mole. What for? Rain! What else? Rain! He's past it. We'll have to elect ourselves a new one. Rain? Oh, yes, of course. Of course, rain. But isn't that little Ruth? Why are we sacrificing her? She's the only virgin we could find at such short notice. If we had more time. <laughs> Even then, it wouldn't be easy. They're very hard to find. But I've known little Ruth since she was... Cricket. We sacrificed chicken, sheep, and bulls, and they didn't work. Hello, my dear. How's your mother? Don't do that! Let me be the first to shake you by the throat! Woman, has gallantly made the supreme sacrifice to save us. With all reverence, we dedicate her to the great god, Mole. 
that he may reward his followers with the life-giving waters of heaven. Say that. I'm courting your daughter, Esther. I'm your future son-in-law. Dad? Kill him! As I tame my anger, I keep it in my pocket. And when I need it, I take it out. I'm taking it out now. Release them! Go your ways! Or else, what can you do? You came here to take our land! Our women? Your crops grow while ours fail! He's a sorcerer! Kill him too! <laughs> and her! Ooh. Kill Noah! He's only one man! I have the army of the Lord on my side! It's all lies! All good. Seize him! Lord, it's your turn. What the Lord God did to Sodom and Gomorrah. He'll do to you only worse. What can he do worse? Else's is dust. How do you do it? I think it's that river. What about that terrible wind last month that blew everything down except this place? Doesn't make sense. The Lord God looks after us. We've decided to leave worshipping Mole and switch over to the Lord. I think it's the sensible thing to do. Uh, it hasn't done as much good yet. <laughs> Well, it, it takes a bit of time for the Lord to get to know you, to see if you're sincere. He gets very annoyed when people pray to him only when they want something. Well, come on. You'll need me. If they try to take you again, you'll need me. Next time, I'll be ready. There's an easier way to protect yourself, Ruth. They took you because you're a virgin. Now, if you weren't, you wouldn't be in danger. Don't try. <laughs> Women say they lost their virginity. Not true. They always know who's got it. you'll protect your honor right down to your dying breath 
but strictly between the two of us. Is it really worse than death? <laughs> Dogs. <laughs> they say that what happened in the temple was a miracle. I've never seen one. What, what is a miracle, really? Well, if a mute told a deaf man how a blind man saw a boy with only one leg run on water, that's a miracle. <laughs> Do you people believe in free will, Shen? Well, we have to. We've got no choice. Why do you keep asking questions? I want to learn. And you're like me. I'm always asking my father questions. Like what? I ask him about love. Clara? And what did he say? <laughs> he said that where there's love, one can sleep on a sword. And where there's none, a bed of 60 square feet isn't enough. <laughs> What do you think about Japheth? Mysteries. Like... Like... Did God create animals? Or people first? And why isn't the sun out at night when we need it most? Hmm. I think thoughts no one else has ever thought before. Like, um, if we, we had fur, like the animals, we wouldn't have to wear clothes, would we? Uh, and another thing, what are colds for? Yes, I, I've wondered about that. Cupid's law. Builder what? Out of gopher wood. Out of gopher wood? I, I'm no builder, Lord. Well, you're no farmer either, but you've prospered. But 300 cubits long, 50 wide, 30 high, it's huge. I think big. I made the world in six days. But how am, am I? You see that stick over there? Yes, then pick it up. Now, draw. <laughs> what is it? Something I have to build. <laughs> what? It's an ark. A what? An ark. What's that? It's a boat. <laughs> what do you need a boat for? It's for the Lord.
Stand here, boys. Going. There's work to be done at home, Father. What's the use? Nothing grows in this heat. That's why we're here having a laugh. <laughs> right! Once more with feeling, everybody laugh! <laughs> They say your father's gone completely mad, bad, and dangerous to know. Who told you that? Is it catching? Oh, of course it isn't catching. Oh, so he is mad. He's a bit strange sometimes. The Lord gives him orders. So it's the Lord's fault. This Lord is your God, but he's got no priests, no temples, and no statues dedicated to him. He doesn't like statues. Nobody knows what he looks like. Nobody's ever seen him. And your father is the only person in the whole world who's ever heard him speak. I think that that makes your father mad. You do, do you? I must run in the family. We have to talk. Yes, I'm listening. When do you want this ark built? Immediately, if not sooner. My family and I can't do it alone. There's only four of us. Stop drinking. You'll get more done. I don't drink when I'm working. Then you must try to hire some help. I tried. I've tried. They all think I'm... Mad. I see. I must help you once again. No. Oh, we'd be so grateful after all. We're, we're doing this on faith alone. We don't know what we're doing or why we're doing it. Or, or what? Noah, you've made your point. Now get to bed. You'll have another heavy day tomorrow. Right, Lord. Good night. Good night, Noah. You are snoring. How did this happen? Don't ask. What are all those hysterical numbers and signs? That's to help us build the ark. But what do they mean? We don't know the code. I do. I know where every piece of timber slots into place. When did you learn that, Father? Oh, last night. Mumble, mumble, snore, snore, mumble, mumble, snore, snore. He was learning how to build the ark. Get to work. Hey!
We want food. Japheth, go and bring some bread. We'll give you from what we have. We want more. You don't know how much we're going to give you yet, so how could you want more? We always want more. Noah! Noah! Don't you recognize me? It's Lot! Your old friend Lot from Sodom! Lot! Lot! Mother, it's Lot! Uh, I never thanked you for saving me. Hello, Lot. <laughs> mm. Where, where's your wife? Dead. Deceased. Gone. I'm sorry. There's a way of the world. What happened to her? She always said she was the salt of the earth. And finally, she was. She was turned into a pillar of the stuff. Here. Here's her finger. What are we waiting for? Let's rob the place! Yeah! Kill the men. Rape the women. Or vice versa. Some of you will die trying. So what? Can't be any worse than living. Rufus, they're friends of mine. If you're squeamish, we will do the killing for you. <laughs> no, Rufus, no. I don't mind killing. <laughs> I didn't expect that. Hmm? I was tricked. <laughs> you caught me with my britches down. Yeah. I want to tell you something with my last dying breath. What is it? It's... What? It's... Yeah. It's... Yeah? Uh, 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 waited too long, Rufus. Drag him away, lads. Those boots belong to me. Lot. Hmm. How can you have become one of these murderers? <laughs> to live. The Lord saved you above all others. Mm, thanks to you, Noah. Yeah, yeah, he saved me. But I had no job, no money. I might as well have died in Sodom, because being poor is like being dead, only you're still breathing. No, no, no. I tried to lead a good life, but I was starving to death. And like other poor men, dying of a broken heart because I was poor. But you were an almost decent man. If you're like this, what are the rest of humanity? Better you don't know. You're the only honest man I've met in all my travels is doing well. A bright world this is, Noah, if we don't lose our hearts to it. But everyone does. Look how dark it is now. You're building a new house? It's an ark. Huh? A boat. A boat. The, the Lord. Lord. Everyone thinks you're mad listening to him, but I know better. You're the only sane man left. You know, I'd worship him too if he wasn't so strict on rules and regulations. Yeah, I can testify he is truly almighty. All right, let's get ready. Come on. Let's move out! Settle up! Get ready! Nama! Tim Ham Japheth! Good luck. Noah, good to see you again. Next time you talk to the Lord, thank him for saving me. And, uh, tell him I'm sorry I wasn't worth saving. <laughs> All right, let's get ready. Come on. Come on. Get down. Sodom and Gomorrah was a warning, but they didn't change. 
This time, instead of fire and brimstone, I'll drown the world in my tears. I'll weep forty days and forty nights, and flood the earth, and nothing will survive. Oh no! Oh no! I do not understand. Why, when you created us, you made us free to sin? Was this some great mistake? I did it out of hope. You'd see the difference between good and evil, and choose wisely. I hoped we'd become a nation of prophets. Oh, be merciful, Lord. Give mankind another chance. They don't deserve to be wiped from the face of the earth. Whatever they've done. Mankind's sins are too great. They started hating each other. And now, they hate themselves. They're destroying the world they gave them. I'll put an end to it all and make it anew. This level is for birds of the air and things that creep and crawl on the earth, like uh, snakes and bugs. I don't like them, Noah. I never have. I never will. Well, you'll have to get used to them, Nama. They'll soon be our traveling companions. <laughs> and this uh, level is for the smaller furry animals. How are we going to feed all these creatures? Goddess, the storerooms are back there in the stern. I don't understand. There are rooms for all the animals, but where are the rooms for the people? Oh, our quarters are up in the prow. No, I mean the other people. Yes, well, I'll explain all that later. Uh, the lower level is uh, for the big beasts, and they're down here to keep the ship. Ship shape. Uh, waited at the bottom. The Lord didn't finish the job, Father. There's no rudder. All boats are supposed to have rudders, aren't they? Garden says the Ark has none. He wants to guide us over the waters. We drift hither and yon. Hither and yon. Hear that, brothers? We drift hither and yon. Hither and yon? Hither and yon? <laughs> Stop fooling. Get back to work. Father, why is the ark so big? We're going to have company. Creepers and crawlers. Anyone we know? Animals. Lots of animals. God is doing the picking right now. Fine mess they're going to make. Who's going to do all the shoveling up? I'm sure the Lord didn't give a thought to that when he dreamed up this idea. He's choosing two of a kind from all over. They're already on their way. the Lord want two of every kind of animal? To 
procreate. What, here? No, no, after the flood. To replenish the earth. There's going to be a flood. Not a flood. The flood. You see any water? Not a drop. Any animals? Not one. Sit on your fat ass and drink while the farm goes to ruin and we starve. The rich swell with pride, the poor swell with anger. There aren't any rich people around these parts here except Noah. I don't understand it. Something smells around here. It's you! Go to bed, Father. When I want an opinion out of you, I'll give it to you! Which reminds me, you stay away from that man and Noah and his misbegotten brood. Japheth. Ah, oh, what a name to give a boy. Japheth. 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 <laughs> Poor devil. No wonder he's an idiot with a name like that. He is not an idiot, he's a dreamer. Like I said, an idiot! Come to bed, Esther. Your father's turning nasty. Who will rid me of my lawfully wedded nightmare? I'd even pray to Noah's God if he could do that for me. Come to bed, you drunken sot! Drink! Never hurt in no one! Been drinking for 40 years, man and boy. Never did me any harm. <laughs> Great stuff. Must make another batch. Is he the right boy for you, Miriam? The whole family's touched. Everybody steers clear of them. In one way, they're fortunate. They could go completely mad and no one would notice the difference. Must be that god of theirs. I know we said we'd start worshipping him too, but frankly, we can't get used to praying just to one god. It doesn't seem natural. He can't be the god of everything. Stands to reason. That's right. He can't be the god of fleas and elephants. Or the god of thunder and bad breath. But they say he is. I admire Noah in a way. He doesn't listen to what other people say about him. When they call him mad, he just shrugs and does what he wants to do. What would you do, Father, if you had the chance? Oh, I don't know. Travel. See the world and all the strange creatures in it. What the? Oh. 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 Oh.
Noah, the end of the world begins tomorrow. I will flood the whole earth and wash away its sins forever.